Do a barrel roll. There it is, Star Fox 2. We're going to teach you how to make your own Star Fox 2 repro for the Super Nintendo. This is very similar to a previous video where I showed you how to make one meg um, repros for Super Nintendo, but this one has an extra step and it's that extra step that makes it a little bit longer of a process, a little bit, a lot of bit longer of a process. Um, and unfortunately, it's a process that involves killing another game. It means sacrificing a game. It means destroying a game, using a game as a donor, which I am trying not to condone. However, I'm going to teach you how to do it. Um, I'm not going to do it personally. I will show you exactly how this game is made though. It's very, very similar. Um, but here, let me show you. So when you open up this card here and in the term, in the realm of show prep, I've already would have already had this unscrewed here for you. Huh? Come on now. You'll see what's going on here. Now this game doesn't use a standard uh, ROM. It uses um, was it like a mask ROM or something? You'll see what I'm talking about here. In fact, here before I open this up, let me show you this. Now this can be a donor. You can use Stunt Race FX. You can use Dirt Tracks FX to make Star Fox Two. It's a pretty cool game. I've never actually played it all the way through. Um, and again, I'm not the biggest Star Fox fan, but still, you know, it's, it's fun to have and fun to see what we could have and probably should have had um, available to us for Star Fox. All right, so when you open this up, now it uses the whole board here. It uses all the surface area. Here's the fun part. That's the guy you want to remove. That guy right there. Pretty hard to unsolder these legs, see how tiny they are? It's pretty rough there, right? So, uh, with these, you want to get these maybe uh, snipped or cut using one of those like cutter thingies. <laughs> Is that a technical enough term for you? Um, I'll leave it in the description below. I'll do some quick research here. But you get this part removed and then it's the same pin layout, except for like the one meg, you're crossing the t uh, pin 24 to pin 31. Just like the one meg uh, Super Nintendo repros, you cross wire. So the rest of them are like, you know, one to one, two to two, yeah, exactly. Except for you cross 24 to 31. But how is this gonna fit in here? Now this one is very, very neat, but look how, look how this one was done here. Now, and I did not do this one, so don't think I did. Yeah. So again, when you pull the game out, like so. So here's it removed, but then all of these are being, the wires are patched through, and you can, and I've, seen, I've seen it hovering above here too, or one to one, two to two. These wires are sticking through though, and they just put this right here, upside down too. If you if I was to pull this away, and I could pull it away a little bit, you can see there's the uh, the EEPROM part of it. So that's just upside down, but still, you know, the first pin here, we can even do it a little bit like this. Like, you know, this one here is going to the first one here. The second one's going to the second one. All of them, except for 24, 31, going to 31, 24. You know, you, you cross wire those, but that's it. That's it. Now this one, again, very, very neat. I did not do this, but you can see how it takes an extra bit of time to get that done. So when you do that, that's really it. That's it. It's a one meg game. You can make it on a one meg repro, but it takes using Stunt Race FX or Dirt Tracks FX. And I'm trying not to destroy any more games. I, there's a special place where I'm going from all the games I have destroyed, so I'm swearing off of all that, you know. So in the meantime, anyway, if you want your own Star Fox 2, yeah, no, I'm not actually going to do it. I'm going to show you how it's done. The previous video shows you how to do the writing of the EEPROM and the wiring and all that, but you can see how much wires it takes. And um, I'd rather I'd rather keep my Stunt Race FX. I mean, not that just because I already have a Star Fox 2, but I, li I like this game too, so anyway. That's a quick video and thank you for watching and we'll have uh, more tutorials on the way as well. There's still there's still uh, several repros that are out there that I haven't quite showed you how to make yet. So if you have a suggestion for something, leave it in the comments below. And until next time, take care and we'll see ya. Thank you.